Just finished aligning this AR88 and the uh, cool piece of refurbishment. Just got to clean up the cabinet now. And it's operating with a um, pan adapter here. Just tune some stations in this one broadcast band. See as I tune the stations, they move across the screen. Tuned in stations in the center of the screen. The amplitude modulation shows the variations in the sidebands on the signal. The IF of the um, DR88 is a little under 455, it's 454.6 that's determined by the crystal frequency that's fitted into the uh, selectivity uh, arrangements in the, in the receiver and the IF of the, uh, the mid frequency of the panoramic adapter is set for 455 so there's a little bit of a discrepancy and that can be corrected for by this uh, adjustment. Uh, for the center frequency. So I think everything's working pretty good. Um, I'll leave it on soak test for another few days, but uh, the alignment went went well. Um, almost by the book. <laughs> uh, but I think it's actually doing really well. On, on most bands, most parts of each band, the AM sensitivity uh, for a discernible AM signal is better than about 0.2 microvolts. And the CW is less than 0.1 microvolts on all bands, apart from the um, the uppermost band where it the sensitivity drops off a little bit, and the, uh, there's a little more noise, and probably due to the due to the types of tubes and so on in this old old set. Anyway, it's uh, I think it's performing to spec. Uh, the IF response curves look really good, and the um, the tracking is very good. There we go. 1942 RCA AR88 and a 1945 or thereabouts panoramic adapter BC1031C.